going to show you how to share a database with ACT by SAGE across a network using different computers. Sorry about the quality in this video. It's one of my first times doing it, so I do apologize, but I think this should work out okay. All your computers must have the same version of ACT data, database or ACT software on each computer. You have to go into the help menu and about ACT to make sure everything is exactly the same. Updates, hot fixes, and everything have to be identical for each, each computer. So you have to purchase a license for each one. Make a database on one of your computers that you want to be the server computer. This database will be located on that computer and it will become your server computer for holding the database. Other computers will be the user computers which you'll use to access that database. After you make the database, you have to find the pad file. It's .pad file located in my documents under ACT, ACT folder, then go to ACT for Windows, then you'll find the database folder, find the pad file in there. Once you find that pad file, You'll copy it and you can either email it, you can copy it across the network, copy it to a, a disk or something and bring it to their computer, however you want to do it. Um, it has a has like a link in there that will link it back to that computer. It's already embedded into that file, into that PAD file. So anyway, you'll put that into your go into your ACT folder under my documents, ACT, same place, ACT for Windows, the database, put it in that database folder. And you'll simply double click that when you're ready to open it up after you get everything else set up. Hi, right, I'm going to show you how to share databases across ACK software. These are some notes you're going to refer back to. First, you got to do is set up your ACK folder for sharing. Go into your ACK under My Documents and go to your database folder. Do a right mouse click on database folder, sharing, share it. Change it so everyone, allow everyone, there'll be a drop down menu there to drop down to find everyone. Back in again for sharing. Your database folder should show up on any computer if you go to that, com that other computer. It should show up as a file you can access. Now you're going to do a right mouse click on Act by Sage application and go down to the open as administrator. This will allow you to share document database. Go to tools, drop down menu, then to database, maintenance, share database should be checked. You should be able to check that since you started up as administrator. Now go to your firewall, allow programs through your firewall. Act by Sage should be there and next schedule should be there. Make sure they're checked. If they're not, you can go to add programs. You want the SQL browser and SQL server also selected. And they're normally not there. You'll have to go find them. And they not too difficult to find, but I've not very many people tell you how to find them. What you want to do is you want to go to your C C folder programs from files then Microsoft SQL server file of SQL server Shared. Find your SQL browser. Add that. I'll add to your firewall. Next one's in the same the same location.
programs file again under C. Microsoft SQL Server, same place. The MSSQL. In SQL Server. Add in. Both in there. All four of them selected. Give that a try, see how it works. And here are some notes to follow.